Hey guys, Jacob with Jacob Comics. Alright, we have a fun episode here. Today I am finally completing my 2099 Spider-Man uh, like 1990s run. So here hopefully in the boxes we have the rest of the run. We're gonna get unboxing it and yeah I'm super excited uh, to share these books with you. Uh, now, as always, if you do like this kind of content, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe to the video. Uh, as always, I would appreciate it as well. Uh, it's the holidays. I, you know, I got a bunch of kids, and I could use any help I could, I could get. Come stop by my Instagram shows. Uh, links down below to my Instagram channel, and buy some comics off me. All right, guys, let's go ahead and get dived into the the uh the books here like i said i'm super excited i uh as many of you know who followed me on the channel here for a while i got into collecting comics collecting spider-man 2099 back in the 90s as a kid he is my favorite character for that reason and this run uh Holds a special uh, spot in my heart. Struggling with the tape. <laughs> Alright. I just don't want to cut the books. Alright. So, uh, do you want to go ahead and uh, put links below? I got the, these from two different IG, uh, IG people. Uh, one uh, from shop for comics is this one right here and uh, this one right here I got from uh, oh my goodness I can't remember I think it's backwall comics yeah <laughs> links are below for their IG um, and yeah let's get dived into the books so from shop for comics we got And some of these are doubles, but uh, in both this this one and this one. But you know, sometimes if they have more than one, I'll just if if one of them's the one I need, I'll just grab the lot. It's usually you know not too much more with shipping and everything. So uh, I did have this one already. So we got a copy of twenty eight and put these right here there's 28 and we got another copy of 30 I don't mind doubles <laughs> and this is the one I was missing uh, first appearance of strange 2099 uh, spider-man 2099 number 33 sorry about the sniffles I'm still fighting that cold a little bit We will get dived into the bigger package here. Now, you guys do want to stick around. These are some pretty cool covers. Uh, it might take me a second here to to get into this one because he's got it in a bubble mailer as well as a Gemini. some some goodies so I want to be extra careful now some stickers I think maybe let's find out guys Just, uh... I am wishing I'd brought my scissors over here <laughs> there's some there's some tape, so I can't quite rip it apart. Come on. If I could just get it past the corner, we would be good to go. Well, I think I can rip along this side, maybe. The biggest struggle. Okay. Well, we could slide these out. 
I got some stickers stoked about this. I don't know what, what's in here, but we got stickers. There's a guy. <laughs> it looks like Peacemaker. Dude, that's totally Peacemaker. So it's like there's a Peacemaker. There's a, some cards in here. Uh, let's let's open let's open this up. Uh, there we go. All right, we got a man. These are this is cool. We got a peacemaker. I think we might have got two of them. Nope, we got a. Uh, I'm not sure who. <laughs> it's kind of a Spongebob guy. We've got, I think that's one of the DC character guy things. We've got, I think it's a card or possibly a sticker as well. Cars. And a Calvin Grove Junior Lightweight. Uh, like a boxing card <laughs> all right some fun stuff in there uh, props to backwall like I said this one's from backwall all right we're down to the Gemini ladies and gentlemen and Blue tape off. Got some more blue tape going on. There we go. We're getting there. You guys excited as I am? All right. <laughs> We're getting to the books. And there was, a, a, you know, to complete the set, I still needed, I still needed a few. So, uh, you know, he, he had a few of these and, and these have been a bit harder to find. Uh, it's, you know, later in the print run and, uh, yeah, just, just, they're just harder to find. So let's, let's go through them. All right, we got a freebie on the top. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man 55, the second printing, Patrick Gleason. And it looks to be a really clean copy too. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll just put it there, I guess. Then we got Spider-Man 2099-42. And if you've never seen these, there there are some pretty cool covers in this in this uh, Spider-Man 2099 run, the later issues. Here's issue 40. Uh, we got issue 39. The super cool AF-15 homage cover by, I think it's by uh, Howard Shaken. It's uh, Spider-Man 2099-37. Here is 36. <laughs> and now you might see too why this little set here is usually pretty hard to find. Here's 35, the first appearance of Venom 2099. And uh, yeah, so these three just always tend to be hard to find. It's later in the run, uh, so the run, you know, the print counts were getting pretty low. And then you get this first appearance of this really cool character. And uh, 34, which also has this really awesome Doom web cover, Web of Doom. And 32, which is another harder to find one, just a really cool Day of the Dead cover. 
And yeah, so these these tended to be the ones that are always a bit harder to find. The last ones I hadn't found, including the 33 First Strange 2099. Ah, I did it. I completed my run. Um, pretty stoked about it. Uh, as always, if you guys like this like this kind of content, like, comment, subscribe, helps the YouTube algorithm spread me out so more comic people find my Fun Times channel. As always, we'll see you guys next time, and have a great day.